Hey guys, welcome back to the farm. It is cold today. Finally feels like winter. We got a little snow stuck on the roof. It is about 2.30. Cal's eaten already. I've got the car cart loaded up with feed because today Jamie and I do our one guilty pleasure that we do. We both get off farm. We go bowling tonight. So I've got to get the feed done before she gets home because once she gets home from work, we got to get going. Um, but I want to check out how many eggs we're getting. This may not be the best day to show you guys, but our egg production has gone up. Let's go check out how many eggs. We'll get this feeding done because we got things to do tonight. So let's get started. All right, back here with the boar pen or what's left since we moved the two pairs of breeders out. We've just got Walter. Walter and Shiloh. So much easier to get in here and feed now. This pen was not the worst though. I'll take you over and show you the girls. Theirs is the worst to feed because there's 11 of them in there and they're big. So let's get Walter and Shiloh fed. Try to do it with one hand on the camera and one hand in the feed and not try to make you guys dizzy there we go boars are good let's go check on uh the first of the two breeding pans we put in for the summer and that's henry and delilah let's go over here and check them out all right there's henry and delilah they are getting along well which is good since it's cold we don't want anyone being kicked out we had some crazy storms and rain but we are still dry up in the love shack formerly known as the quack shack yes henry i'm coming they want me to shut up and uh just feed them instead of talk about them there's one and here's the other so we haven't noticed any action delilah over here come here come on there you go haven't noticed any action yet. The girls haven't come into heat. At least Delilah hasn't. I haven't checked on, uh, well, maybe. Uh, no, not yet. <laughs> She's not in heat yet. So, no action yet, but Henry will get the job done. How you doing, bud? Doing better now since we got some food. So, here's Henry and Delilah. Doing well. Let's run over and check on, uh, who's the other two? Ryder and Chloe. Cal, you can't go in the duck house. They don't want you in there. I guess we should feed the ducks too before we go. Ducks have been starting to give us a lot more eggs too. I think we got eight eggs this morning. We'll go check on Chloe and Ryder. And then we'll go check how many chicken eggs we are starting to get. as well bring you along for the younger pigs they're a lot easier to feed even though there's a bunch of them they can't really knock into me and knock me over especially with all the rain we had you can see their feed bowls were down here i had to move them this morning got a ton of rain pretty bad storm the other night but we're good so let's see if we can get these youngsters fed Maybe they'll prove me wrong and they're a little harder to feed than I am expecting. Excuse me, excuse me. Easy, Betty. Hey, tidbit. speaking of tidbit she's the smallest probably one of the youngest too she was getting out every day we couldn't figure out where why she was getting out and then isaiah figured it out over here when this fence runs up and down these little hills and everything she could sneak out right underneath this fence here so we put a couple rocks a couple sticks 
and uh she hasn't got out anymore so she is staying in. she didn't go anywhere she just go over there by the donkeys and play in the leaves and do some rooting around over there but she's staying in with everybody now these guys are all good i do love that there's a lot of them in here and their hay is dry that goes for all our animals so we know they are warm when it's cold it's supposed to get down to 19 tonight not too bad hey betty there's betty white how you do did i miss a bowl that's what you were telling me i thought you were just wanting to say hi there you go that's better well now you don't even want that one you want the one someone else is eating out of there's willow bean look at that curly hair i think she's got curly hair for this cold jesse and of course here's molly is that good molly pretty good huh all right let's go check out some breeders What are you doing? You don't want to run anymore? Are you catching a ride? Huh? No, you want to run? You better get some of that energy out. Let's go. The other two lovebirds, Ryder. Got a couple of leaves on your head there, bud. You haven't been digging, have you? Ryder and Chloe. I know you guys don't want me to talk. You just want some feed. Hopefully I grab this bucket that has enough in it. There's one for you. And one for you. There we go. Let's study this back out. So Chloe and Ryder doing well. You always want to make sure they go in at night. She has not come into heat either. It's only been a couple days. They come into heat every 21 days. So we'll keep an eye out for when that happens. You lost your leaves. Oh, they're in your bowl. Keep an eye out for when that happens. And obviously you guys will be updated and we'll mark that day on our calendar when we'll be expecting piggies. So let's go back and check out these eggs. How many we're getting now? all right guys well we have been getting more eggs than we had been and uh cows are coming towards me way over in that field just wondering what they're moving at but we have been getting a lot more eggs and nothing that we've changed we've got them on the same feed everything else but it's just that time of year where the days are getting longer and obviously they feel like they don't have enough room in their laying boxes <laughs> there's one out there so let's count and see i'll try to go as fast as i can that's one two three four and always sometimes there's some underneath how's everybody doing down there here's two more that's six we always got to check underneath oh none over there but we've got one hiding over there in the corner let's reach in and get that there's number seven and i see a white one a white one right there so eight in this coop it's always fun after it's rained how muddy it is oh there's more snow for you we already got a blizzard oh i'm glad i came in there's another over here so that's nine in this coop. That's a good start. It has been weird. They've been laying in uh, mostly one coop. But this one's got nine in it today. So this is the coop that they have been putting the most in. And you can see it is loaded up. So try to count these fast 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 and i'll pick them out after we're done talking to y'all so you don't have to waste your time watching me 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 
25, 26, 27, 28, 29. And four is 33. I see one up there in the corner, 34. Let me get my big head in here. So we're at 34. We'll collect those in just a minute. So that's not bad, almost three dozen. 34 and four is 38. 39 is easier. 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51. And that is if there's none hiding in the fronts here. So 51, none in there. 52, 53 in there. So guys, 53 eggs today. I'm gonna collect these, but that's not all. I found a hidden spot and I moved the eggs and there's more in there, so I know they are fresh. So what did I say? I gotta go backwards and figure that out. Here, so guys, 53 eggs today. Let's go check that hidden spot. Okay, so I recounted as I was collecting them. It was 53. But in here, we always have some birds that leave every day. Here is four more. So 53, 55, and 57. So that is, and no, they are not for you. That is a fantastic haul. Excited the chickens are starting to lay more. And like I said, we haven't done anything. It's just the days are getting longer. Your chickens need to take a break in the winter when the daylight's short. You can have a duck egg later, okay? When the daylight's short, so the days are getting longer. Chickens are starting to lay more. We are excited, and the people on our waiting list for chicken eggs will also be excited. So, appreciate you guys following along. If you haven't already, check us out on Instagram and Facebook. Don't forget to make the change. We'll see you guys on the next video.